Here's how to record your new 3DS or new 2DS without a capture card. First, let's click on the Luma 3DS link in the description down below. Next, we'll scroll down once we're on that page and click the boot.firm file. Next, we're going back to the description again and clicking on the boot NTR link. We're going to scroll down and click on the boot NTR selector.cia file. Now, depending on your computer, you'll pick whatever one you have. For example, I'm using the PC for this. So I'll click the PC link and scroll down and click the Snickerstream x64 zip file. Now we're going to take our SD card from our 3DS and put it into our computer. And then we'll move the boot.firm file to the root of our SD card. Next we'll move the boot NTR selector file to the CIA's folder on our SD card. Now we can eject our SD card and put it back into our 3DS. Now we'll turn on our 3DS and go to FBI. Go to SD, next go to CIA's. Go to Boot NTR Selector and press A. Then install CIA. Press A to confirm. Then press the home button and we'll get a new present on our home screen. But before you open it, we're going to need to hold the left shoulder button, the D-pad down and select. Next we'll go to the debugger options and we'll press A to enable debugger. Press B. You now have your 3DS IP address on the top right of your bottom screen. Make a note of that and then disable debugger. Press B until you exit the menu. Now we can open the boot NTR selector. Once that's open, press use default, then save settings. Then select 3.6. Now go to your computer and extract the Snickerstream zip. You can delete the zip folder once it's done. Click the Snickerstream application. Enter your 3DS IP address that you made note of. Now click connect and allow access to your firewall. Now you can record your 3DS without a capture card, but something to note, this only captures video and not audio. If you want to do that, you'll need a 3.5 millimeter audio cable. And if you want one, there's a link in the description down below. So if you purchase one, you help out the channel at no additional cost to you. If you want to wirelessly transfer files to your 3DS, watch this video right here. Thanks for watching.